very special thing we've yet to there reveal. We're delighted to announce that Life is Strange and Life is Strange Before the Storm return in an Nintendo all Switch. new remastered collection featuring enhanced visuals. Yes, let's go! A remaster! Let's go! Remastered collection, fall 2021. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel, and I'm back from the Life is Strange video. So this will be our first video talking about Life is Strange Remastered Collection, which was something announced at the Life is Strange Square Enix event a couple days ago. This is going to be a full-on fledged remaster of Life is Strange 1 and Before the Storm. And there's a lot of details you may not know about this, so I'm going to go through everything that you need to know about this and we're going to have a couple more videos discussing, you know, some first look images as well, which I will show in this video, but we're going to describe them in a different video as well. And basically, if you have any questions in regards to this, hopefully by the time this video is done, you will basically have them answered because I'm going to go through every little thing you need to know that they have basically told us or shown in some degree, shape, or form. So if you enjoy this video, be sure to drop a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, join about 38% of people are subscribed, and help us try to hit 295k very, very soon. Alright, let me know your thoughts down below in the comments, what you think of all this information, and we're going to get straight into it. Hope you enjoy. So the official Life is Strange account tweeted the following, Life is Strange and Life is Strange Before the Storm will return in an all-new remastered collection featuring enhanced visuals and animations. Available as part of Life is Strange True Colors Ultimate Edition or standalone later this year. So I want to talk about that end part right there, that last sentence. So, if you pre-order Life is Strange True Colors Ultimate Edition, which is up to $80, you will get the remastered Life is Strange along with it. And I believe you're going to be getting it in September. Now, they clearly stated in the trailer that it's going to release in autumn. So the standalone version, so if you do not get this ultimate edition you are going to have to wait until the full on version releases later in the fall so my expectation for this is that probably if they're releasing this in september with the true colors ultimate edition my guess is probably it's going to be october november ish when you're going to be able to play the full on game so it's pretty obvious they're going to wait a couple weeks maybe a month or two after the ultimate edition people get their version and then they'll release it to the general public for the people that didn't get the ultimate edition and stuff and want it separately now the platforms you're going to be able to play this on are stadia ps4 xbox one steam this is being made mainly by deck nine with partnership with both don't nod and square enix so i don't believe there's going to be a playstation 5 xbox series x slash s version as far as i know Based on what I'm seeing here, things could change, but right now, based on what I'm showing you here, that's what it says. So, um, you'll be able to play it, though, obviously, through backwards compatibility and stuff. So, if you check through the Steam page, you're this is where I mainly have found all the information that most of you people probably couldn't find unless you did some deep searching like I did. So, if you go on the Steam page, they talk about a lot of the stuff that's included in the improvements and stuff. The description has experienced the BAFTA award-winning story of Life is Strange, now beautifully remastered with enhanced visuals, vastly improved animation using mocap technology, and also Before the Storm. Now, there's a separate Steam page for Life is Strange Remastered, and a separate Steam page for Life is Strange Before the Storm Remastered, which I found pretty odd, but, you know, very, very interesting with the fact they say. So, here is the description of Life is Strange Remastered Collection. Return to Arcadia Bay and experience two award-winning Life is Strange games like never before. Remastered visuals and animations breathe new life into the great cast of characters and gripping stories. The Life is Strange Remastered Collection includes Life is Strange Remastered and Life is Strange Before the Storm Remastered. Here are the features. Remastered visuals across characters and environments. Vastly improved character animation using full facial mocap performance. Updated and refined gameplay puzzles. Engine and lighting upgrades. Includes previously released de deluxe content, Chloe outfits, and farewell bonus uh, episodes. So, if you didn't play Life of Strange before the storm, let me let me run this down for you really quick. So, the Chloe outfits, if you did pre-order, you got some bonus Chloe outfits you could pick in episode one of Before the Storm. And the farewell bonus episode, that is a, 
you know, one of my favorite episodes. It's a bonus episode to Before the Storm. So technically, Before the Storm, you have the three episodes, and then you have the farewell bonus episode. So that will be included in this as well. Choice and consequence-driven stories with multiple endings. Harness the power of max rewindability. Chloe's quick-witted attitude change the course of events. Distinct licensed soundtrack and original scores. Now, another thing that's also going to be included is a pre-order bonus. So if you pre-order Life is Strange Remastered Collection... Uh, you will receive the Zombie Crypt outfit for Chloe. Zombie Crypt outfit is only available for use in Life is Strange Before the Storm Remastered. Life is Strange Remastered collection includes Life is Strange Remastered and Life is Strange Before the Storm Remastered. So, you will get this outfit that I'm showing on screen here, the Zombie Clone. You can kind of look at Chloe. Um, we'll describe it here a little bit as well. So, we have one image from the original Life is Strange and one image from Before the Storm. These are the first look images we have in regards to the remaster, and I could say there is some improvement. In the next video I probably make in regards to the remaster, we're going to discuss the before and after type images. But I'm just going to show you guys the new images here, so let's go through the Life is Strange one first. So, this is our only image of, right now, Life is Strange 1 remastered. And you can tell visually, face-wise, and just graphically, the game looks better the backgrounds everything stands out more and especially when we go through the before and after images you'll really see the improvement that these images have but you can tell this is what they're aiming for with especially with the mocap technology and the lighting you can tell this is definitely going to feel like partially a new game and here is our first and only image again from life is strange before the storm from episode one Again, you can really tell the facial animation, how the characters look, the backgrounds, the lighting, everything stands out more. Especially, again, when you see the before and after, you're really going to see the improvement. And let me know what you guys think of these. Do you think this is what you'd like to see, or do you think there needs to be a little more work? Because, personally, in my opinion, both of these images that I've showed you do show a significant amount of improvement. And we'll make these games feel definitely new to people, especially that have not played Life is Strange for a while. And one more look at the Chloe Zombie Crypt outfit. Definitely another new look at Chloe that maybe you haven't seen yet, but this is definitely using the new graphics. It's kind of low res quality because I had to up it up to 1920 by 1080 to get a better look at it. But here's a look at Chloe. So that is going to do it for the video. Those are the images. We're going to talk about those more in-depthly in the next video I discuss this. But if you guys want to do me a favor, be sure to drop a like, subscribe, turn on all post notifications mm -hmm. as well. Follow me on my social media, stay connected with us. And let me know if there's any videos you'd like me to discuss in regards to True Colors or this remastered version. So hopefully I have given you, that is pretty much everything we know right now in terms of Life is Strange remastered. So if you guys did enjoy this video again, thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you all next one. Peace. You're so very special.